Hello and great to have the pleasure of your company. Our match today comes to you from the Estadio Presidente Perón. My name is Derek Ray and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And every reason to believe we're in for an entertaining match here. It's Brazil versus Mexico. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. The starting 11 for Brazil. Rafaelito Anjos begins between the posts. Adrian Zonta starts with Michael Catarino in the fullback positions. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. Here's how Mexico will begin the game. Well, they're also playing in a 4-3-3 formation, but they play it in a slightly different way, particularly in the wide areas, where their fullbacks will get forward and rotate with the wingers at every opportunity. And so the battle commences. Jesus Corona. Luis Romo. Alvarez now. Good tackle. Well, who will be the player to decide the outcome, to determine the course of events? No reason at all why it won't be this man, Stuart. What do you anticipate seeing from him? Well, Derek, he's the perfect finisher. He's got a great shot on him. His movement is excellent. And in 1v1 situations, you always expect him to score. Edson Alvarez. Romo. Guardado. Rosano. Guardado. Well, they're keeping their opponents moving and guessing. Tremendous block. And he did well to cut it out. Lozano. Andres Guardado. Losing possession here. But he keeps going. And that is offside. Lozano. Now Funes Mori, Romo, and they continue to advance, and a lot of options here. Not a great pass. They're certainly allowing their opponents to come onto them. 
And Brazil come away with it. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. I think I spoke too soon. Wasn't the best of passes, finally. Good-looking sequence. Well, possibilities inside the box. Guardado. And it took a touch on the way through. So a corner here. Over it comes, a deft clearance. Rosano, Romo, and space for the cross. Luis Romo, cross blocked. Takes the shot. Save, but still a chance. An opportunity to forge ahead from this corner situation. <laughs> Playing it short. Andres Guardado. Romo. Now can they make something happen? Still passing it around with authority. Edson Alvarez. And he read it superbly. Now a decent position. And a wonderful diving save to deny the opportunity. Corner kick played in. And it's in! 1 0. They breached the defence. Well, here's another look at it. Certainly, delivery into the box couldn't have been any better. And then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. That is that for the first half here. Well, he's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Stuart? Well, I'm sure the manager will be delighted with him. He'll have drilled it into them to keep their focus, keep playing through to the half-time whistle, and it's certainly put them in a good position to go on and win this now. Second half is underway. Brazil behind. Can they turn this match on its head? Good looking move, this. Options in the center. Might really be able to trouble them here. Can he take the chance? Terrific save.
Funes Mori. Rodriguez. Alvarez now. Guardado. Won it back. Well, he's lost the ball. Montes. Well, they're sitting ever deeper. Andres Guardado. And the pass, a good one. Every pass hitting its target. Jesus Gallardo. Alvarez now. And playing it to the goalkeeper. Looking confident with the ball at his feet. Not all that convincing defensively. Well, they can bring it out now. So a throw in here. And they're making a change. Did look they might be onto something for a second or so. And a body in the way. Montes inside the last quarter of an hour well they're quite content to knock it around inside their own half well there to intercept Still pressing for a goal here. But really sticking to the task defensively. Jesus Corona. And the attack looks promising. Julio Cesar Dominguez and couldn't keep himself onside Inside the final two minutes of this contest. Trailing as they are, they're not likely to get too many opportunities late in this game. Well, nothing for the players in the middle to work with. Julio Cesar Dominguez. It's with Araujo. And there goes the final whistle. It's gone the wrong way as far as the home fans are concerned. Well, Derek, certainly not their best performance, was it? Just a little bit off the pace for me, and obviously a disappointing result. But the key thing is, they bounce back now, and they can't afford a repeat performance. No two ways about it. He really has brought his influence to bear on the proceedings. Yeah, good performance, and a really critical goal to give them the lead. They just couldn't cope with his movement today.